this is the ongoing collaboration with Home Educate and Mad Lads. Um, it's a gardening video, <clears throat> so if you don't like gardening, then don't watch this video. Um, I've got a very poorly baby at the moment. She has just cacked her pants um, very severely, and and I I also have three-year-old who will not stop asking me questions why is there so much ink in the pen why everything why do i have everything that just everything just why do everything i know that's good it's good because i can answer questions like that but i'll just put my boob away because the babies fell asleep not that you needed to know that but you know i've got neighbors over the road and oops, i don't want to just be sat here with my boob out Although they've probably seen it many times. Anywho, I decided to wash, I don't know why, I have no idea why, but I decided to wash my hair with, uh, a friend got me a sugar scrub. And because I don't, I don't use shampoos or body washes, um, I thought, hmm, what that's that going to be like on my hair? And I don't know if you can see, but it's, I thought, oh, it's a sugar. I mean, I should have checked because it wasn't just sugar. It was kind of like oily. Oh. Oh. Now that the dog barking, horseman was here. And we have, I have something. I, I don't know what it is, but what that first I have a letter that my grandma, she's not my grandma. I don't even have somebody who I call grandma. But my daughter does, so for some reason I said to call my nana's grandma. Um, don't open it yet. I, I, I don't know what it is, but I'm going to open it. Let's see what it is. A tiny hole. Um, Melody's going to open it. Yeah, keep opening that top bit. It has. It actually has. It actually. Mm, what is it? Did have on top of it. So I had to do it from that tiny hole I made. Uh, Quick, get it out. Put it down on the bed then. Over here so I can see it. Goodness me. Ah, it's just a design and technology course book. Um, I, I like to... I like to get little, these little books, they're not little, the GCSE books, just because there's a lot of like, information in them. I don't I don't get all of them because we don't do all of the things in them, but, you know, like, um, I got a business one the other day, which like, shows you the in and outs of business management and whatnot. So, as you can imagine, there's going to be more planting anything today. <laughs> Not outside, at least. Still pretty, though, isn't it? We do already have potatoes out. But I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure they'll be fine. I've got all these pots to plant the many tomato plants that I've grown in on the window ledge. So what are we doing today? Farming. We're planting some seeds, aren't we? Seeds. There's a, a bee or a wasp just hovering there in the same place. Anyway, so we've got some potatoes here, here, here and here. Then we have some radishes here. And... Some tomatoes here, although some of them have died off, so we're going to plant some different ones there. This was where 
Brussels sprouts were. But there's only one that has survived. Uh, and we have broad beans here. Some strawberry plants from off of my mother plant. Tomatoes. And we've got some onions over at this falling over over this fence but we've got a big box of seeds here with onions oh let's have a look oh gosh so we see what we've got we have some turnips we have some tom oh no these are tomatoes that we already planted courgette um, some thing we have some more Brussels sprouts, some runner beans, we have some cabbage, we have some cauliflower, we have some peas, sweet corn, onions, and they've fallen out, they've fallen out everywhere, parsnips. Sweet. Some um, munch too. Some more Brussels sprouts. Oh, well done. Travis is replanting this um, cutting that we got last year, which is coming along nicely, finally. Some lettuce. Salem's emptying out all the things that didn't flourish. Lettuce. Some more onions. We have some more onions, <laughs> some peas, some runner beans, some carrots, some leeks, some broad beans. Oh, that's it. All of them to plant in this small area. Yes, I said munch too. Film <laughs> those munch too, don't you, Sills? Yeah, I ate like half a bowl last time for him to go. So we've tried to have a productive day with the gardening, but I don't know. My it hurts to crouch down. <laughs> and when I've got Jesse on my back, um she's work i'm going to get her in a minute when i've got jesse on my back it's even harder so i've planted a few onions i've bought three rows of onions and travis has dug over some ground and Sam's cleared some pots and we've watered some plants and alexander Oh, he replanted some tomato plants. Um, but I'm not sure we're going to get much further. It's just staying warm now. It's not going frosty anymore in the morning. So <laughs> I best go and get her. I finished this. Right, so it's not going frosty anymore. And it's, it's, it's lovely. Lovely weather. So this is the end of this month's um, collaboration video. And hopefully things have shot up quite a lot more than they have now. And no more snow, please. No more snow. Lovely, lovely sun. Maybe a bit of rain. Maybe a bit of rain. Because I'm tired of... We haven't got a hose at the moment, so... I'm tired of taking water from the duck pond. Or from the tap. To take it to the plants. Okay, it's doing me good. I don't know if you can tell, but I've lost... I've not lost weight actually, I've, it's shifted, it's shifted, I've lost fat, so, yay. Okay, um, I hope you have a beautiful day, and pop to um, Home Educating the Mad Lads, and see the other collaboration um, videos from the gardening. 
Um, everyone's garden's beautiful, land is beautiful, so they're worth a watch. Goodbye.